One man, a million haircuts. Honoring those who serve. No matter their time in service, our nation's veterans continue to wear our country's uniform in their hearts and minds. USAC TV salutes all our veterans and brings you the story of one who served in World War II. Although he got out of the Army after the war was over, he's continued to help the troops in a very unique way. Our Ron Andrus has the story of one vet who is still taking care of soldiers. I'm the oldest barber and the longest barber on, on this post. I recently sat down with Army veteran and infantry hall barber Hubert Webb. Hubert was drafted by the Army and served in the 2nd Infantry Division during World War II. When the war ended, he got out of the Army and went to barber school on the GI Bill. He started his career at Fort Campbell and then moved here in 1964 and has been cutting hair at Fort Benning ever since. A lot of people was in this building at that time. Of course, the wars were still going on, you know. When I come here, there was five barbers chairs in this room here, this little room here. Three across there, two back there, shine man in the corner. 62 years, three major wars, and over a million haircuts. Hubert has cut hair for soldiers who served in Korea, Vietnam, the current war on terror, and everyone in between. Well, I've estimated uh, at least a million. I cut uh, General Westmoreland's hair. I've cut a lot of generals since then, post commanders since then. I guess I've cut every post commander that's been here since I've been here. So what's the key to Hubert's longevity? I never was a drinker. I never was a smoker. I don't know whether that has anything to do with my being 89 years old, but it, it, it didn't hurt. <laughs> and how does he want to be remembered? My haircut I give you. <laughs> I want him to think I'm interesting, I'm all right. I asked Hubert how long he plans on continuing his career here at Fort Benning. Another 89 years. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> then, I'd be, then I'd be an icon. So if you're in or around Infantry Hall, stop by and say hello to Hubert. Or better yet, come in and get your hair cut before he retires and you miss your chance of experiencing a little slice of Fort Benning history. Ron Andrus, USAC TV.